Hi, I'm Riley Hubbard, and I represent the Lincoln pickup team. Yeah! The title of this piece is called Dollar Bill. They say money is the roots of all evil. All of our apathy, agony, misery, and spite is rooted in a green piece of paper. It makes us all paper chasers, hunting with the hunger for wealth, but the real hunger games are in the streets. We claim to be developed as a nation, but in reality, we are a nation of disarray and frustration. Some of us are lucky enough to take vacations, but most of us are stationed because poverty is our creation. Working out loud from nine to five, but the drive for a fatter wallet is never silenced. The silent majority yearn to scream, but their mouths are shut with fibrous duct tape, sealed with the words, in God we trust, even though making dough is more of a must, and trust has become an afterthought. Some of us trade our childhood for some change. Oh, but not the change like Barack Obama represents. Change like dollars and cents. Working minimum wage to fight our way out of a fiscal cage barricaded by a rising cost of living. All we do is give our hours time and time again 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 to the business machine. Give up our lives and work till midnight because even though our will is strong, the money is always right. Some of us have to keep the cash flow and the academics sailing, keeping our grades above water while our sanity drowns. We're living in an American irony painted in red, white, and blue because let me tell you, there is nothing free in the land of the free. We have to realize that we can spend our time on money, but not our money on time because we're inept to the grand perception that our time is wasting away and our paycheck status is no exception. We work like clockwork, just to clock out, only to get clocked by an uppercut from life, yet we rise to get back into the ring to take another beating because we all need that dollar bill.